more than eightfold higher risk of major heart attack for under 50s who smoke. Smokers under the age of 50 are more than eight times as likely as non-smokers to have a major heart attack, making them the most vulnerable of any age group of smokers, reveals research published online in the journal Heart. All smokers have a significantly higher risk of having a heart attack than non-smokers of the same age, but it's not clear what the magnitude of that risk is among different age groups. To try and quantify this, the researchers drew on data for 1,727 adults undergoing treatment for a classic type of heart attack known as ischemia at South Yorkshire's Regional Specialist Cardiotheracic Center in Sheffield, Northern England, between 2009 and 2012. Ischemia, or ST-segment elevation myocardial infarction, refers to the typical pattern seen on an electrocardiogram, ECG, indicating that a large portion of the heart muscle is dying. The researchers also used data from the Office for National ST. Household Survey, ONS IHS, for the South Yorkshire region. Among other things, this collects information on smoking prevalence and other aspects of perceived health. Almost half of the 1,727 patients, 48.5%, were current smokers, with roughly a quarter, just over 27%, former smokers, and a quarter, just over 24%, non-smokers. Current smokers tended to be 10 to 11 years younger than X or non-smokers when they had their STEMI. And along with X smokers, were twice as likely as non-smokers to have had previous episodes of coronary artery disease. They were also three times as likely as non-smokers to have peripheral vascular disease, a condition in which a buildup of fatty deposits in the blood vessels restricts blood supply to the legs. Based on the ONS IHS data, the overall prevalence of smoking in South Yorkshire was 22.4%, with the highest prevalence among those under the age of 50, just over 27%. But among STEMI patients under the age of 50, smoking prevalence was almost 75%. Overall, this risk fell with increasing age, dropping to a five-fold difference among 50 to 65-year-olds, and a three-fold difference among the over 65s. The researchers say that the much higher risk of STEMI in younger smokers is not easy to explain as this age group typically don't have many of the other contributory risk factors that might be seen in older smokers, such as high blood pressure, high cholesterol, or diabetes. Smoking may therefore be the most important risk factor, they suggest, adding that other research shows that the fatty deposits furring up the arteries of smokers differ from those of non-smokers and seem to be more vulnerable to rupture. This study is based on one regional specialist cardiotheracic center in England, and it did not include patients who died before admission or who were deemed unsuitable for treatment at the center. Nevertheless, the findings prompt the researchers to call for greater efforts to be made to help younger smokers stub out their habit. All current SMO